Well, after a rainy season last year, the Winnebago County Fair kicked off its 2023 season today and is looking to bounce back. 13 WREX's Emily McMinn visited the fairgrounds, learning how this fair continues to grow and what unique additions are making it a must-see attraction as they push for a big turnout. Here at the 102nd year of the Winnebago County Fair, organizers continue to bring new offerings to the community, including unique additions they hope will boost attendance. With the long-standing tradition of the fair, the president of the fairgrounds says they have experienced changes over the years to continue to allow for more community members to attend. We've uh, added more acreage. We're up to 126 acres now. When it first got here, we were tied with the uh, park district, and now we own all the property here, so it's, uh, it, we're growing. In one of the additions they're making with this extra space includes bringing more unique offerings not present at most other fairs. This year that includes blacksmith Bryce Vernon, who says getting out in the community at events such as this one makes his job that much more rewarding. It's really neat to share my passion with so many of the people that seem to be very interested in it, you know. Like I said, there's very few of us around. Um, I'm an almost entirely self-taught YouTube University and to be able to show somebody else what I wish I would have been shown as a kid is just really, really fun to do and really unique. Another one of the more unique offerings is a wood carver who also enjoys the community aspect the fair is sure to bring. I mean, it's cool. It's, it's awesome to, you know, I make people happy. People love wood carvings. They love watching people make wood carvings. It's art that happens instantly almost. And Vernon just hopes fair visitors will enjoy seeing something unique to this fair. It's neat to kind of have a blacksmith at the fair. It's not something you see every day. It's pretty rare. There's not a lot of us left, believe it or not. So I, I hope some people come to watch and kind of check it out. Reporting in Pecatonica, Emily McMinn, 13 WREX.